right, so this is something that they've already actually seen because it's at the very end of the trailer. Yes. Uh, this is our Noglin. Uh, this guy is adorable. They're very cute, uh, but they're also very dangerous. Uh, what they do is they use that mouth and that tongue to latch onto their victim and then start uh, exercising a little bit of mind control. Oh, man. Mind um, control. Yeah, mind control. <laughs> what? Uh, All right. Yeah, this right. guy is very, even though he's, he comes in a small package, he can ride on your shoulder. He is very, very, very capable. Could be very feared because he can go from, you know, your favorite Rex that's been your pal for God knows how long, all of a sudden turns into your enemy. Uh, you know, one of these guys gets attached to it and they can, your friends can suddenly become your enemies and start attacking you, oh even though yeah. they're survivors. Um, so it's it's going to definitely change up the meta quite a bit. I know when we po when we posted this picture, a lot of people, uh, you know, was wondering if it transformed, kind of like, you know, we've done in the past with Genesis 1. Everybody was just expecting this big BC transformation. So you heard it first here from Zane. It's not exactly that. Uh, but it does exercise some mind control if it's able to latch on to you, which could be, that could be an interesting change in the current meta. Uh, I don't think we have anything current quite like that in our current game, do we? No, no, nothing that comes even close. <laughs> yeah, so I, I could imagine this being a, a interesting switch up, uh, you know, for people that are, you know, potentially are PvP or, um, you know, like it, it could be a lot of interesting strats that could, that could emerge from this. Um, I'm interested to see how the community likes it. What are we seeing in the chat? Are we seeing good things? Since you can't be live to greet new... As, um, it's basically sound like everyone's saying how cute it is. Probably oh, it's cute, but it's it, it can be deadly. Yeah. But let's see, a couple of different questions asking about the new trainer and is it dateable and just, I leave all. It's important to know. All right, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and throw this out here now. <laughs> We're not going to share everything mm. about these creatures. And we're not going to share everything about Gen 2 as well. So the things that you see today, this is not everything. Mm -hmm. All right? So we're not just going to come out here and show everything that's going to be in Gen 2. We're going to keep some things behind the scenes and surprise you guys when Gen 2 comes out. But you'll see a good portion of what Gen 2 is going to be about today. But we're not going to reveal every specific mechanic about them. Uh, because honestly, it's a little bit spoilery. A lot of people <laughs> like that, um, you know, that excitement of getting on the first day, figuring out how to tame it or right. if it can be tamed, figure out its personalities and what's the best methods to do it. Um, that's exciting to me, and I think it's exciting to a lot of players. Um, we don't want to spoil every single feature about these things, but we are going to give you enough to let you know how to start thinking about how you want to walk into Gen 2. Uh, what else we got in the chat? How you, how you guys are feeling? Well, I can I can divulge a little bit. Okay, here we go, Zane. I mean, it, what can you imagine these guys would like to tame on? I mean, if it mm. already... If it, Ooh, look at you. It already works on people's minds and Dino's minds, so maybe you're going to have to work out some sacrifices or something like that to oh. get some of these guys on <laughs> your side. Um, a lot of fun with this. This, this guy has definitely been a lot of fun. Oh, man. The sacrifices. I'm sure uh, there's a lot of people that's going to like the sound of that. I'm sure they have plenty of things ready to sacrifice, uh, <laughs> depending on what it is. Yeah, especially with some of our breeders. They've got quite a few excess dinos that a lot of times will just kill out. Yeah. Mm. So you heard it. Uh, there's going to be an interesting way of getting a hold of one of these that may involve some sacrificing <laughs> of things you, you have or you love uh, or you know. Um, so yeah, how are we feeling about Nog Noglin? You like the name? That's a good name. I like it. Noglin? 